Former boxer Gary Boletto and the Cranston YMCA are celebrating the opening of Rhode Island's first adaptive gym. The gym allows people of all abilities to work out. Maury Hirsch Gordon was at today's event and gives us a look inside the gym, new at 530. Following a 10-year career as a professional boxer, Gary Boletto's life changed in 2013 when he became paralyzed from the chest down. Today, he and his foundation opening doors for thousands of people experiencing similar challenges. Surrounded by loved ones, Gary Tiger Boletto and his foundation making an indelible mark on Rhode Island Tuesday afternoon. And he's an icon because of what he's doing for himself, but also more importantly, he's doing for others. The official opening of an adaptive gym at the Cranston YMCA allows people with all forms of paralysis the chance to exercise. I don't like to go to a spinal cord injury gym that I've I've went to before by, by myself secluded with other people with injuries. I want to go with my family. I want to go with my friends. Is any time that we can work with someone in the community and really serve a community need speaks to the power of this organization. The gym has 10 machines worth $100,000 and this access to state of the art equipment for a simple gym membership is simply unmatched. When I first started going to a gym that was just made for people with spinal cord injuries, it was $200 for a workout. It just made me sick to my stomach. I hope this is going to be a model for other gyms or other YMCA's throughout the country. And there's roughly 20,000 people in the state with some form of paralysis. The Cranston Y will have specialty trained staff at their location five days a week. Maury Hirsch Gordon, Eyewitness News.